what's going on everyone and welcome back to another video today it's going uh yeah about time i finally make one of these videos it's hard for me to make videos that aren't related to donkey kong or rosalina can you blame me guys i promise i do this last year but i freaking lied but now is the time we talk about mario and luigi superstar saga the series is turning 20 this year, and I think it's a great time to celebrate by talking about all the Mario Luigi games. I'm going to go one by one with each series, of course, and uh, just to make sure it's not too stacked or anything. I would probably rank them, but I'll do that later. I did technically do a Mario RPG ranking a while back, but yeah, that was really it. But yeah, we're going to be talking about Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. Let's get this started. Alright, so let's go ahead and talk about, well, the plot itself, I guess, right? I mean, it's a Mario RPG game. This is, you know, I love Super Mario RPG and Paper Mario, but what about Mario and Luigi? Let's throw in Luigi in the Mario RPG title for once. Yeah, this was Luigi's first time playable in the Mario RPG series. Luigi's always the le bro that always gets left out on an adventure, but now he finally decides to go with his brother for once. Cool. <laughs> I'm... Huge Luigi guy, so yes, he deserved it. Anyway, let's go and talk about the plot. Uh, Princess Peach, um, someone uh, delivers a present to Peach's castle and spits out uh, some little gas or some, some, I don't know, something like that. And just, Peach just faints? Huh, that's, this is already good. We're already in for a fun time. And then, um, of course, Toad rushes back to Mario's house to explain what happened, and, um... First off, um, Toad saw Mario naked. Welcome to- <laughs> Welcome to- Welcome to Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. And it's up to Mario Luigi to see what the heck is going on! And of course, you got a Bow Bowser. Happy Bow Bowser stuff goes on. Uh, a character known as Cacletta is taking over the Mushroom Kingdom and the Bean Bean Kingdom, and many areas around this place. So it's up to the bros to save the day. So yeah, that's the plot of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, and I can say that just for the first attempt, it's pretty good, honestly. Um, I guess I could also talk about the areas themselves. The locations are fantastic, honestly. There's just a lot of unique areas. In the Bean Bean Kingdom, per se, uh, you got a lot of areas like, you know, Tee Valley, Stardust Fields, one of my personal favorites, Hoo Hoo Mountain, uh, Bafar Ruins, cool I guess, and Jokes End. Yeah, Jokes End, that's the snow area. <laughs> so yeah. Well yeah, that's the locations, and of course the bow system. It's pretty much similar, if you play Paper Mario or Super Mario RPG, the concepts are pretty much the same. And you just press A for Mario to do your attacks, whether it's jump or hammer. And with Luigi, everything, you press the B button. Um, same thing with jump and hammer. And they also have uh, something called the Bros Attacks, which is basically, you know, two brothers working together to actually do a bunch of damage. Just use up your BP or SP to be on the game you're playing. And um, you gotta make sure you have enough, you gotta make sure you get syrup if you want to actually use those attacks a lot. So yeah, it's pretty cool to really see um, it's really cool to see stuff like that, and I honestly really like the, the I really like the battle system. It's really good, and a lot of people say the Mario Luigi series is better than the Paper Mario series. That's an objective fact. If you disagree with me, too bad. And um, yeah, and also the Mario Bros just have unique attacks uh, in the overworld too, like Mario using his hammer to break blocks, Luigi using his hammer to hit Mario to go through tiny spots he couldn't go through. You have the Mario's fire and Luigi's thunder uh, to use in obstacles, and of course jumping really high. Well, the Mario Bros just do everything to make sure they work together and stuff like that. And overall, the per I don't like using the term personality in these games. But man, there's just something charming about this game, honestly. It's just overall a fantastic GBA game, honestly. And the character designs are pretty good, too. And one of our uh, popular favorites, actually, is Prince... Prince... Yeah, you. Peasley, yeah, that's the name. Which, a lot of people say she could have a crush on Luigi or something like that. A lot of people ship this, apparently, online. Do I have a problem with it? 
Eh, I don't have a problem with it. I'm not a Daisy fan, anyway. <laughs> um, anyway, moving on. But yeah, there's that, I guess. A lot of people love to ship that character a lot. But, um, and also the enemies and stuff, all the obstacles, just the way Luigi acts, honestly. I just love this charm a lot. And the amount of enemy stuff, and also the battle theme. <laughs> Yes, the battle theme is very, very good. I don't need to say mo I don't need to say more about this. And of course, with pretty much every Mario RPG game, there are side quests to tackle, which you know, uh, try to get as many, just get uh, gear and stuff to make your bros do whatever, which is a lot of damage. Won't take as much damage, stuff like that. And every time you level up, you choose a bonus stat to go go through, which is attack, BP, um, HP. Defense, speed, which you go fast. Basically, if it's your turn, you go faster. Or stash, which is lucky hits. So yeah, there's just a lot of unique concepts with this game and the series going forward, which we will talk about uh, for sure later on. Not not today, but later. And of course, you got dodgy enemies. You got to attack them, counter attack. There's just a lot of concepts in this game that makes me. It makes me understand, and for a good reason, why the Mario Luigi series is so beloved by many people. And yeah, it's just it's just such a great series, honestly. Um, I know we've talked about only Superstar Saga, <laughs> but yeah, but yeah, there's definitely a lot of charm with Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. Everything about it is just fantastic, honestly. Which is the characters, the music, everything about it is just fantastic, and. I can definitely say right now that Superstar Saga is a fantastic GBA game. I'm unsure if it's my favorite in, in my favorite game on the system. It could be honestly, but it could be Wario. But that's probably Wario Land 4. Sorry, Waluigi. But yeah, it's just overall Mario League Superstar Saga is a fantastic game um, with a lot of charm and stuff. If I had to bring out a, I don't really have any flaws per se. I guess most of the flaws are really just the end game being difficult, but that just adds to the. Ch that's just, I just love that kind of difficulty anyway, so, yeah, if you're not really into it, you gotta get used to it and stuff, make sure you get a lot of items and stuff like that, cause, yeah. Um, oh yeah, there's also that scene where Luigi, um, dressed up as Princess Peach. Now we know who the best princess is in the Mario series. <laughs> uh, there's also that Geno cameo, which never, when then, that was the last time he ever appeared in the game again. I wish he wasn't Smash Bros. Yeah, I fucking said it. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and talk about the end game. After going straight to Bowser's castle, you have to fight Bowletta! Yeah, that's her name. And then you have to fight her soul? Okay. After getting eaten. Vor! This is a children's game! <laughs> um, and then, after you defeat the soul, you quickly get out the castle, and that's the game. That's Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. So this first attempt... Yeah, it's one of the best GBA titles, one of my favorite Mario RPG games in general, honestly. I really love the art style, too. That The the, the art style, which is used in plenty of Mario parodies and fan animations and stuff like that, it's just overall really good, honestly, so yeah. Oh yeah, did you know there was a remake on the 3DS? Yeah, there was a remake. Released in 2017, around the Switch days, we got a straight-up remake of Superstar Saga. This was pretty exciting for me, honestly, because I really love Superstar Saga, so I really wanted to try this out. And I will say, yeah, it's pretty good. The art style is pretty similar to the 3DS Mario and Luigi games, which I will talk about later on this year. And, um, overall, it's not much I can really say, just some nice quality improvements and stuff like that. Um, I wouldn't, not sure if I say it's better than the original, it's really debatable to be honest, but otherwise, it's, yeah, it's, it's nice, honestly, I also love the boss designs, they kept the original characters and stuff like that, I didn't even talk about the bosses to be honest, I really like them, honestly, and the music is just as good as the OG, maybe in some capacity, I'm not sure about the original battle theme, I don't know, man, the music, music in both games are really good, honestly, so, yeah. Oh yeah, what makes this different from the original Superstar Saga? Oh yeah, there's no Geno in this game. RIP, already a downgrade. <laughs> um, there is a Bowser's mode called- a mode called Bowser's Minions, and it's not good at all. It's like Pegman in some capacity, where you have enemies just automatically attacking other enemies, and you have moments where your enemies just die and stuff. 
It's just such a boring experience. I don't understand. It's just so boring. And there's some nice dialogue you'll get from it, but yeah, that's really it. It's just very, very boring, honestly. Just don't play this mode at all. Just play the original game. It's just better, honestly. So yeah. Um, but yeah, that's all I really got. It's a pretty cool remake, though. I'm not sure if I probably replayed the original more. Honestly, I really need to play 3S Remake. Yeah, I've only played it once. But yeah, it's it's really good. Doesn't matter which version you play. Play Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. It's a fantastic game. Oh boy, I think I pretty much talked about everything. Characters, worlds, bosses, etc. Yeah, that's really it. I love Mario and Superstar Saga. This is a great start to this series. It only goes downhill from here. From here, kind of. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time. Uh, sometime this year, I don't know if it'll be in a few months, but I will be talking about Mario Luigi Partners and Partners in Time. I'll do this every two, three months. Hopefully, I'll do all of the videos from Mario Luigi games before the before the end of the year. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time for more. Later, folks.